Number 1. John Houteling A True American Success Story Formerly a salesman of used Chevys, John got his start in a mailroom working for $8 an hour carrying boxes. But that didn't stop him from showing up one day in a suit and tie. He was told he looked silly and to come the next day wearing jeans, but John persisted. Fast forward a few years later and now he runs one of the largest firms in America that advocates for policyholders. We know him as the man that secured millions after Hurricane Katrina to help rebuild thousands of properties across multiple states. Number 2. Chad Wilson This is the lawyer that knows how to support a major effort. He got his start in the world at the U.S. Merchant Marine Academy and served aboard one of the first supply ships to Kuwait after the U.S. Gulf War. Two degrees later, he spent 20 years in oil and gas before going to get his law degree. He was featured in one of our videos highlighting his victories against State Farm. Definitely someone you want to know. Number 3. Steve Badger First known for his involvement after 9-11, where he pursued wrongful death settlements for victims of poor airline security. He is also known for having the largest single settlement in history with an insurance company of $1.2 billion. Yes, with a B. Now, Steve regularly writes about and has a reputation of being the insurance industry enforcer, fighting improper and illegal conduct in weather-related litigation. Number 4. Lawyer Brit What is the one thing you go looking for in a lawyer when going after an insurance company, above all else? One who has never lost a single case against an insurance company, of course. If that's who you're looking for, you can settle with Brittany Alexander of Premier Property Law. Number 5. Trent Cotney One thing you are going to learn when you get into commercial roofing is that there is paperwork. Endless paperwork. That paperwork can determine your success as a company to a higher degree than your skills as an estimator or the efficiency of your crews. Trent has won so much for the industry by advocating for contractor-friendly statutes and literally writing the book on OSHA defense. You can't lose with Trent in your corner. Number 6. Evan Wolf, a champion of generosity. Once a winner of the Pro Bono Award from the Florida Bar, probably because he learned how painful the insurance process could be at a young age when he and his college roommate burned down their house cooking dinner. Number 7. MMA. Not one man, but a group of men. Zach Mosley, Pate Smith, Bo Killingsworth. This group produces a lot of great content online and does a lot of business development to stay on top of all things currency and remaining truly in touch with the industry as a whole. Number 8. Harvey Cohen After litigating thousands of cases, this man knows what he is doing. For him, it's all about justice. They are aggressive, zealous advocates for their clients' rights. Number 9. Philip Sanoff the specialist in getting positive injury verdicts for policyholders. When looking for a lawyer on a dead claim, you want a man who's a fighter and doesn't even take his own passing as a final conclusion. At 5.33 p.m., he was in a rollover car crash, flown by helicopter to a hospital where five hours later he was pronounced dead. However, he went comatose for a few months, fought his way through that, to eventually spend over a year outside the hospital in therapy. The man understands the power of why, you know and understand the why, you do the work. Today, his why is to make sure that other victims know this too. The Roofing Insights Award Ceremony will take place on December 9th at Mangos in Orlando, Florida from 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. during the 2021 Roofing Process Conference. You can purchase tickets at the door if you're not attending the conference.